Hi, this is Michael Ogechi Abbey with Enterprise Express Tax Service. Uh, just here this morning talking about the problems that are going on right now with the IRS, the Internal Revenue Service. The Internal Revenue Service is the primary um, uh, government organization that collects taxes in the United States. They're responsible for collecting taxes. They're responsible for giving out refunds. They're responsible for uh, what we in the industry call tax administration. There have been a number of issues over the last couple of years, but what's happening, it's really been building up to the point now where it's gotten to a point where the IRS is not really able to efficiently process uh, returns and uh, give out refunds in a timely and efficient uh, manner. That's not to say that the agency is not doing what it's supposed to do. Um, for instance, take take you know uh, take uh, into consideration this ta uh, this tax filing season. Um, they are able to process a majority of the tax returns for the 2021-22 tax filing season, uh, primarily because of e-filing. Uh, electronic filing is the method by which the Internal Revenue Service electronically processes your tax return. So uh, there doesn't have to be a physical person who actually gets into the return. Uh, it's all done electronically with, uh, with computers. And for the most part, it's relatively efficient. The problem we're having this tax year is uh, during the COVID period and over the last couple of years, the IRS technology has not really been up to date. And so what's been happening is the e-filing uh, process uh, has not really kept up with some of the um, issues that have come up with personal and business tax returns. And then when that happens, the IRS has to kind of, let's just say, take those returns that cannot be processed electronically and have a uh, physical person uh, attend to those returns. Um, especially with amended returns. An amended return is when uh, you have an issue with a prior year tax return and you have to make changes or have your tax preparer or your accountant make changes to that return, which the IRS in turn has to review, process, approve, and then either send you a refund or you know just make some, some, some calculations and some changes based on information that you have provided. Um, as of now, the IRS is able to electronically file a prior year tax return as an amended return, a prior year. So if it's a 2020 uh, amendment, um, it, it, it can be e-filed so long as it's presented and e-filed in 2021, okay? So prior year. Um, however, if there's anything that needs to be amended prior to the prior year, <laughs> I'm trying to make this clear, okay, then uh, it's not possible. You have to mail it in. It has to be processed uh, physically. And that's where there are issues because the IRS is so far behind their backlog. Why do we have these issues with the IRS? Why is the IRS having these issues? Well, for one, there's a big funding problem. The IRS has been underfunded for many, 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 many years. Um, Congress has not been able to really get together to prioritize and allocate enough funding for the IRS to one, upgrade their computer systems, and two, to hire uh, enough people and enough uh, trained uh, uh, people uh, to do what needs to be done. And that is a, a big, uh, a big issue. Uh, and, you know, right now, um, they are they do not have enough staff to take care of the backlog that has accumulated, especially over the last two years with COVID, and uh, and that's a that's a big that's a big uh, that's a big issue. So that's why they're so far behind. Um, the IRS uh, for this tax filing season has actually come out and said that it's going to be very very challenging, and I actually like what they've done. They've they've come out straight and they've said, look. This is a challenge in tax year. These are the problems we're having. And this is why we will not be able, we may not be able to get your refunds out to you in time. Now, having said that, being a tax practitioner, um, I will say this, they, they, they're actually doing their best. Um, 
just looking at what's happening this filing season, the, the e-files are going through pretty okay. Um, they have not been that as many um, computer problems. I'm talking about the IRS servers as they sometimes are. And so I think that if most um, taxpayers are able to get their documents together uh, as accurately as possible, uh, you should not have any major, major issues. I think where you have an issue is if you do not have the proper information or the more, most accurate information, that's where you might have a problem in terms of delayed refunds and so on and so forth. So the key thing here is this, just make sure you have all your information in order. Um, even if you have to wait a little longer to ensure that you get the correct up-to-date, you know, your W-2s, 1099s, um, any retirement income that you may have forgotten. Um, if you had a, a job that you did for two weeks and you stopped and you just forgot about it and they have not sent you a W-2, you want to give them a call, make sure you have all that information because as you know, uh, any way you work, any earnings you make, uh, a copy of those earnings statements goes to the IRS and then you're supposed to get a copy as well. We know what happens sometimes. People move. Uh, it could be a number of issues why you did not get your copy, but you, you want to make sure that you have that. One way to ensure uh, that you have what you need <coughs> is to um, uh, go online to the IRS website, www.irs.gov. Set up an individual um, account, and that way you can actually um, uh, request a transcript that uh, shows uh, what you earned, um, you know, or where you earned, or what you earned. And that'll give you a pretty good idea if you have all the items that you have. Okay, but if you're absolutely sure that you have everything you need, just go ahead and uh, and uh, either you know if you're doing TurboTax, that's fine, or if you're using a tax practitioner like myself, that's perfectly okay as well. Okay, so I just wanted to give an update. This is just an update on, you know, there's lots of stories going around what's going on with the IRS, you know, you know, are they shutting down? No, they're not. Uh, but they are having some unique problems. I call it like the perfect storm of events, especially with COVID. Uh, and, um, you know, we're just going to have to uh, work with them to um, get through it. Another thing that I would advise people to do, you, you know, talk to your local congressman. Uh, you know, we want to start a real push for more funding for the IRS because it's it's needed. Um, this is our taxes we're talking about. So we, we definitely need the IRS to be up to scratch uh, and at, at their most efficient. OK, once again, this is Michael Abbey with Enterprise Express Tax Service.